I really want y'all to know women are terrible fucking people. I don't care how nobody put it, flip it. Honestly, I could not agree more than what she just said. I say this all the time to people all the time. Be like, you got a lot of male friends, and people think like, oh, I don't mess with females, and that is not the case at all. But it is the case. And it's not that I don't mess with females. Like it takes a particular female to understand. But most females are trash. Like they just are. Like men for me is easy to be friends with because. I know the true intentions of a man. Like most likely, all a man want to do when they see me or when they want to be with me, first off the top, is probably they want to, you know, be intimate. But if I shut that shit down, like it can't go any further than what I allow it to go. And people will stay in a place as long as they feel that they need to stay in a place. There's no other intention. But with females, like you don't know why they want to be your friend. They can want to be your friend just because you have somebody that you don't get along with and that person you don't get along with. They want to be friends with them to click up or maybe, you know, somebody like maybe popular or can get them in bars and stuff. So they want to be friends with you just because they can benefit off of that, who you know, where you can go. And then you got the weird females. That is the most funniest part right there when she said this part. This is hilarious maybe popular or can get them in bars and stuff so they want to be friends with you just because they can benefit off of that who you know she doesn't she doesn't want to be with friends with other women that take advantage of her because she's somebody or she can get them access to something or provide resource and value she doesn't want to be friends with people that would take advantage of her resource or her value she doesn't want that they're going to use <laughs> that's what Rima, women date us for that same she's mad that she sees a woman doing what she does to man to her and she date women sometimes too she date both men and women that's the funny that's man that's hilarious that's hilarious oh where you can go and then you got the weird females that are just be like they don't really like you but they just want to be friends with you just so they can subliminally talk about you like it's just nuts and just as she said in that video, yes, a lot of them females are mad needy. Like I, I have too many issues within my own self that I have to figure out and things going on in my life. I cannot sit here and deal with a female friend who wants me all day, every day, calling, texting, nonstop, blah, blah, blah. Men, I can go without speaking for months and then they'll hit me up like, yo, let's go kick it. And then we can go kick it like nothing, nothing changed. But females be so quick to be, I want to be your friend no more because you didn't come up for my birthday party. But you didn't even come to my birthday party. I sat there and bought you a gift. You didn't even give me a gift. It's like the nerd. But if I go to my male friend, I ain't even got to give him a birthday gift and they don't even care. And they'll still end up giving me something like, ain't it supposed to be about the thought? Like, but it's always like a tip or tap for females. And I just, this is why I just choose to rather deal with guys than it is with females because y'all and it's probably beyond that but you know i'm gonna keep it right there for right now but yeah if you want to be a female friend of mine just know i'm a real one i ain't got time for no drama i got time for none of that i ain't even known that type if i don't like you i don't like you i'm gonna let it be known that i don't like you and it's just that simple for me i really want i want y'all to understand this video is pure gold guys she goes on and say how women are terrible people and all this other stuff, but she names all the ways it's easier to deal with guys. She goes on for two minutes and 53 seconds to name, tell women how easy it is, how easy men are satisfied in relationships with women. They don't ask for much. His birthday come, if you don't do much, he don't really care. We don't care for our birthday to that high extent that they care about their birthday. She she's saying things without realizing what she's saying. If I was in a, a relationship and my birthday came, she had birthday, you know, we don't really do much and I go on by my job. I don't really care if her birthday come. She wants a celebration. He we can go missing a birthday and not care. The woman can't go and miss a birthday. She will be upset. Why you didn't say my birthday? Why ain't get no gift? Why you ain't do nothing for me and stuff like that? She's not even realizing how she's breaking it down. She's she's forgetting that she's a woman herself and she will require men to do these things in a relationship. Not realizing that she's with men, it, it, even though they're not in a relationship, she's saying how it is to date a man 
without saying how this is a data man. She's breaking it down like it's so simple. You could date a man and it's going to be easy. She's breaking it down simply like it will be easy to deal with a man than a woman because of all their requirements. And then women still can't keep a man. Men are easy to deal with, easy to satisfy. And women still can't keep a man. She doesn't have a man. She have a whole bunch of male friends. And the biggest red flag with me is this, that this woman is with a whole bunch of male friends, which I believe provides no value to this woman. Because guess what? This woman gets on social media every day, asks other men on the, the platform, oh, um, I need advice. I need advice. Why do you have so many male friends and you can't get no information about relationships? Why do you have so many male friends and you can't find a man? If she was my daughter, I'd be like, you have all the male friends. Do you date any of them? And if she say no, I'm like, so what is their value? What is their purpose? Because it doesn't make a man, any man that wants to date her is not happy to see her surrounded by a whole group of men and be like, okay, that's the grandma. No, nobody. She's surrounded by a group of men all the time that provides her no value zero value when i'm talking about value i mean like in the context where she could they could benefit her life to the point that she can find a man the purpose is that she's looking for a man she's looking for a boyfriend she can't find it she can't keep one she's breaking down how easy it is to be with a man and how easy it is to please a man but then she can't keep a man to save her life she's surrounded by a group of men she call her friends and she's asking guys on TikTok every single day relationship questions. And I'm trying to figure out, like, what about them group of guys that you have around you? What value do they provide in? Because if they're not helping you find your husband and move on from that friend group, they're hindering you from finding your husband and moving on from that friend group. It doesn't make sense. These women think that, oh, you know, it's a, it's a good light that I have a lot of male friends and stuff like that. Lady, that's not an attractive thing. Nothing good. No, nobody thinks nothing good about them guys surrounding you all the time. Them guys ain't helping you find your husband or find a man. They're hindering you from finding anything. And they're not criticizing you because it it would be crazy. Them same group of guys going to male podcasts or on conversation saying that, oh, this 30 something woman's a failure. But your, your female friends are failure. She don't got no man. And she'd be on TikTok asking for advice for how to find a man. And y'all not helping her. They show credit. The, the reason why she's more comfortable with them guys is also because they don't criticize her. If they criticize her and held her accountable, she would not want to be friends with them. She would not want to be friends with them guys. They are not holding her accountable for her actions. They are not holding her accountable for her actions. She's failing at dating. Them group of guys should be helping her trying to find a man. Them guys are not helping her find a man. They're hindering her from finding a man. She's dependent on this group of men now because she don't want to be around women because she feel like women are leeches and taking advantage of her and only want her for some arterial motive and stuff like that is is crazy, guys. This woman is trying to make it um, seem like women are horrible. You are a woman. <laughs> you are a woman and you can't keep a man. So what group do you think you fall in? But like, I'm subscribed, guys. Like, I'm subscribed.